So Arsenal have made their first summer transfer of 2021. It's Nuno Tavares. I've probably butchered that. Give it a game where he's in an Arsenal shirt, probably in pre-season, and I'll get the name right. I don't know how to pronounce it as of yet. So, yeah, I'm just going to say Nuno. Um, of course, we did announce this earlier on today. I had um, didn't have a lot of sleep last night, so I ended up sleeping during the day. I missed the announcement, and uh, I've only really got myself together properly to sort this out now. So this is my reaction. Obviously... Fabrizio Romano was the big scoop on this one, really, a couple weeks ago. Came out of nowhere. Benfica back up left back, 21 years of age. It looks like £7.8 million. Pounds. I'm not sure if that's Euros, though, of course. Kieran Tinney signed a five year contract not too long ago. And this is looking like it will be Tinney's backup, which we have been lacking. We needed a backup. It's not going to be our star signing, but it's a guy who we definitely needed for the time and uh, yeah back up left back um, from Benfica he was there back up left back as well 21 years of age on uh, Tavares Tierney's 23 so we got that left back spot sorted I will talk a little bit briefly now about the Congo it looks like he will be on his way as well 21 years of age Belgian from uh, midfielder from Anderlecht. People have comparisons, of course, to Yuri Tielemans, who came from Anderlecht to Leicester City, of course. Scored that goal against Chelsea in the FA Cup final as well, not too long ago. So, I'm not sure what type like of midfielder he is, but I'm sure he will suit Mikel's system. Looking like most likely going to be a Ceballos um, placement. I do like this, though, because 21 on Nuno, I think. 21 on the Conga. For once, we're using squad depth as young players or up and comings coming through. Of course, don't know if you know, but I can't say his name. I'll say his first name, Arthur. One of the uh, academy goalkeepers has been promoted as well into the first team for the new season. Signing a new long term deal. So that's good to see as well. I've heard good things about him. I think it's Arthur Okongu. I think he's Nigerian, but I'm not too sure. He might even be English, but I don't know what nationality he as was I to, um, put it on my research there, but I digress. Welcome to Arsenal and Tavares. Of course, with Tini's injury record, it's good that we can have somebody there that can actually play that position because you can't just rely on Granit Xhaka to do it. And we're so Kalasnac leaving the club age 32. It's nice to see that we're not replacing him with another 30 plus year old. It's somebody for the future. Same with the Congo, so Bars was never going to get another looking. He's definitely not going to be in the Madrid squad, that's for sure. But that's a video for another time. I will be making a video on the conga, as and when. Most likely, it probably won't be today. Definitely won't be tomorrow. So my next video should be my reaction to the Euro 2020 final. Just look out for that one. I'll be very drunk, so beware for that one. And uh, yeah, welcome to Arsenal Nuno you know, Tavares. Smart signing, one of hopefully many more to come. Um, stay, take care, stay safe. See you guys for the next one.